says the time machine core needs to be reset. Great. What does that puzzle look like? A round thing in the middle. Think. Hey, it looks like I can reset the core from here. No clue. But I, I did help Paul set up the machine at the university. Which then caused the fracture. Look, Will knew the calculations were wrong. I'm hoping that means he knew what he was doing here. This is what Will is leading us to. We have to test it. The core. That's what we set up first. could actually be the key to finding the countermeasure. We'll see. It's still resetting. The core is reset. We need to activate it from the control booth. I think the control doohickey's right here. I can't insert the date yet. It's a hell of a thing, huh? Jesus, look at this thing. One? Here goes nothing. What, what was that? It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. It worked. It actually worked. Okay, we activate the corridor next. Oh, Jesus, look at that thing go! This was the final step. I need to set up the machine first. These schematics are all in Will's writing. He did all of this. Built everything. Monarch was made aware of its existence shortly. The corridor. It's key activated. Will's key. Thank God. Whoa! Did you guys see that? Will's key did that? Yeah. Key to a time machine, and he left it in a trunk of his goddamn car. <laughs> That's my brother in a nutshell. That didn't sound good. Fuck. Let's just hope it still works. You said Will built a countermeasure. What makes you so sure this isn't it? The time machine? He said the countermeasure was stolen. The machine is still here. The schematics for the countermeasure spanned 11 years, 1999 to 2010. In itself, that wasn't strange. But the guy built a working time machine in two. Something's wrong with the machine. We don't know that. You're not trained for this. Anything you do is gonna make it worse. We you can't know I'm right. Stop trying. You lost people. You're angry. I get it. But this is bigger than us. We can't fix the machine. But I might know somebody who can. Sophia Amaral. The monarch scientist. I saw her video near Ground Zero. It's 
Tarine's had a crown in research. She'll be at the Monarch Gala tonight, but security's airtight. She'll be nearly impossible to get to. Unless I have an invite. Paul told me he expected me to meet him at that party. Something tells me that was not a friendly invitation. Jack, no. The future used to be so clear when I was reliving the past. Once I caught up to the moment I had left, that ended. All I've had to go on since then are the plan and the visions. I knew Jack would come to me. I'd seen that, but I didn't know why exactly or how it would end. There is. You were right. My visions of the future aren't always clear, but they don't lie. Speaking of lies, Joyce is saying he's discovered his brother's time machine. We've spent 17 years looking for it, and he finds it in less than a day? It does sound unlikely. Still, we know it's out there somewhere. We don't know what his brother managed to tell him. If he really has located the machine, why would he come here and tell you? Smart Money says he's trying to play you. Maybe, but the machine is out there. It's in our interest to find out where. If Jack knows, I have to talk to him. Dr. Joyce could have provided the answer to that question. William's attitude and knowledge made him a liability. Is that angry young man going to cooperate any more than his brother did? You remember Jack as a close friend, but that clouds your judgment. Don't make this personal. It's not. But don't forget why we're here tonight. After what happened, our people need reassurance that we're in control. You're the man who could win them over. Let me handle Joyce, so you can concentrate on your speech. I know what's at stake here, Martin. Mr. Joyce is waiting for us down below. What are these doing here? We should be set up by now. It's all on schedule. You're micromanaging again. Don't even twitch. And here you are. I had to see the lifestyles of the sick and traitorous up close and personal. And it was such a nice imitation. How do you want to deal with this, Paul? I could still try to reach Jack and make him see reason. Or I could let Hatch deal with him so nothing would distract me from leading Monarch. I once trusted Jack more than anybody. It was my only chance to make him understand the truth. The fuck do you mean nobody got a look at the shooter? But without me there to give the speech, my empire would start to crumble like a house of cards. I believe that with hope comes miscalculation. And as you and I well aware, Mr. Joyce, with miscalculation can often come catastrophe. And that leaves me with you, Mr. Joyce. 
But my old friend would be a lost cause, dead and buried along with the rest of my past. Tonight is a celebration, a celebration in face of darkness. Tonight we celebrate because I promise to you that we are prepared. Monarch would grow stronger with my presence. The plan would go forward as intended. We didn't come this far to get derailed now. You talk to him, find out what he knows. Then get rid of him. You're all heart money bags. I know you want to make this all about you and me, Jack. But that's far away in the past now. And I have a speech to prepare for. I've seen where this leads. I've been to the end of time, and I've escaped it all the way to 1999, when it all started. I've tried to change things, but by trying, I only made them happen in the first place. Security was tight at the Monarch Gala. You took quite a risk walking into the lion's den. If we were gonna kidnap Dr. Amaral, then we needed to do it from the inside. Beth Wilder. You were quick to trust her. We had common interests. Is that all you had? That's all we needed. Thanks for showing up. Here, I thought this was gonna be a rescue. Right, there's a story here. You know a guy called Hatch? Serene's right-hand man. He was here. He gave me this big speech about how he wants to take down Paul. I hope you said no. I didn't trust him for a second. He set me loose anyways, told me to wait for an opening. I just gave you one. Appreciate it. What's it look like out there? I think you're secure. Everyone's concentrating on the party. So far, your crazy plan's working. And Dr. Emerald? I don't have a fix on her. She's either at the party or at her office at the R&D facility here on the island. I'll scout out the party. So you're gonna sip champagne while I break into a high security installation? It's like you got this all figured out. I'll save you a cocktail, weenie. Oh, well, in that case. The cover isn't gonna survive the night, but it'll last a little longer, so you can't walk out the front door with me. This is the quickest way to the R&D facility. I disabled the security at the back door, but there'll be guards. Contact me when you're clear. And Jack, you know what's at stake here. This can't be about revenge. I'm not here for Paul. Hey! He's escaping! will hurt in the morning. My powers were growing. I was learning to control them better. That felt good. <sighs> Who the hell designs these doors? 
Okay, I'm gonna have to move fast. Okay. Very sci-fi and very monarch. Something tells me it wasn't commissioned by them, though. Hey, Beth, I'm clear. What's next? You'll see a radar tower overhead soon. Let me know when you get inside. All right. You could have warned me about that one, Beth. Okay, how am I getting to that radar tower? I need to get across somehow. Must be a way across. Mm. Uh, up you go. Try this again. Dry docks off turned into a disaster. It's gonna take them weeks to clean it up. It was all supposed to be quietly swept under the carpet, but now we've got a shitload more bodies to disappear. Well, at least we got it under control now. Target is out on God damn it! Keep fire! Oh my god. Time felt broken here. The timeline of the old cannon felt loose. I could shift it around. Smart place to aim the cannon, guys. Hey, Kate. Monarch projections say these stutters are getting more frequent. If one hits while we're grabbing Dr. Amaral... He'll be frozen. Yeah, I know. It's a risk. Monarch specialist troopers have the stutter-proof gear. I bet Dr. Amaral would have that. Enemy!
that's it. Time felt broken here. The timeline of the old cannon felt loose. I could shift it around. Smart place to aim the cannon, guys. I've been thinking. Monarch projections say these stutters are getting more frequent. If one hits while we're grabbing Dr. Amaral... You'll be frozen. Yeah, I know. It's a risk. Monarch specialist troopers have the stutterproof gear. I bet Dr. Amaral will have that in her office, too. I'll keep an eye out. Let's see if I grab it for you. I can't believe that Joyce guy just gave himself up. That's crazy. Yeah, well, it's locked up tight now. was all supposed to be quietly swept under the carpet. But now we've got a shitload more. Oh, disappear. Time felt broken here. Timeline of the old cannon felt loose. I could shift it around. Smart place to aim the cannon, guys. I've been thinking. Monarch projections say these stutters are getting more frequent. If one hits while we're grabbing Dr. Amaral, you'll be frozen. Yeah, I know. It's a risk. Monarch specialist troopers have the stutterproof gear. I bet. Heads up, we got the intruder. Shit! the radar tower. Where's the lab? Blow your feet. Don't have a secret. The elevator inside will take you down. Whoa, seriously? What is this, a Bond villain layer? You have no idea. Just don't fall into the shark tank. Fuck. Thank you. 
sent to you the CFR. It's a regulator. It's a good monarch, the audience. This device has been at the heart of our Cronon research since 2010, but I am here to assure you that it is so much more than just that. This device will be our salvation. And the Beth, I'm about to take the elevator. See Paul still fond of his own voice. Yeah, he's talking about his survival plan. Crowd's eating it up. Dr. Amaral's office. Looks like that's one level up. The device drained my powers. We refer to it as a chronon damp. Serene ordered Hatch to kill me because he didn't want to put his plan at risk. But seeing the scale of that facility, I started realizing just how deep that plan went. It made me wonder. Time was ending. What was it all for? Dr. Amaral's office. Looks like that's one level up. Thank <laughs> you. 
It was clear that Monarch had been building the Chronon technology for years. They were prepared for the fracture. None of it would have been possible without the CFR. Which way is everyone's office? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm guessing this isn't the usual employee route. <laughs> Dr. Amaral's office must be close. No alarms. Looks like nobody here knows about the mess I made on the way in. Good job, Beth. That's Amaral's office. The yeah, Amaral had tried to warn Paul. The end of time was approaching quickly. Less than 24 hours away. Mr. Serene believed it would take years to run its course. Admittedly, he was wrong. That there looks like what Beth wanted. Oh, shit. Amaral's at the party. The stutter won't last. 
I better find a way out of here and get to the party. Quite expensive piece of tech you stole. Bill me. I knew Beth's cover wouldn't last long. I had to get it to her at the party before it was too late. Guns made to operate in a stutter. Paul had clear priorities. When time ends, guns don't. Sounds like we're out of this place. All I had to do was make it to the garage. Seems simple enough. I got eyes on her! That's Jack Joyce. Isn't he supposed to be locked up? And easier. There's gotta be a way out of here. Huh. Oh shit. Okay. talking about. Beth, I got that device for you, but Dr. Amaral's at the party. Yeah, I just spotted her. Wanna be my date? Yeah, save me that cocktail, weenie. I'll make my way there. Serene's finished his speech, and he knows you're loose. He's headed your way. Remember what we said. I'll keep talking about Switch the monarch. Stay out of here. Beth? Beth? Beth?
Beth, I got that device for you, but Dr. Amaral's at the party. Yeah, I just spotted her. Wanna be my date? Yeah, save me that cocktail, weenie. I'll make my way there. Serene's finished his speech, and he knows you're loose. He's headed your way. Remember what we said. I'll keep... Beth, I've got company. I'll see you at the party. Great. God, that's the last of them. We need the exact coordinates for Joyce ASAP. Monarch Actual is moving in to intercept. This is Monarch 5. Just spotted him entering the tunnel system outside the party grounds. Huh. Again. I could see the mansion where the gala was. I had to find a way to get there. I could see the energy. Huh. Again. I could see the mansion where the gala was. I had to find a way to get there. I could see the energy field of another monarch chronon dampener. It would drain my powers. I'd have to find a way to shut him off. Focus. Incoming. 
Yeah. Now we're talking. For the party. What was your plan? I needed to get to Dr. Amaral before the stutter ended and Monarch found out I was coming. should be here somewhere. Need to get to her before the stutter ends. Mr. Serene's speech had been a success. The world was falling apart, but the wine and cheese crowd was enjoying their little goddamn soiree. before anybody notices. Okay, lead the way. What's our plan once we grab her? There's a boat dock right outside the mansion. Okay, we can make that work. Time kicks back in and that drone turns us into paste. Let's get to it, Doctor. Oh, 
Oh, where's the damn boat? It's right there. Okay, go! Get her on the boat, I'll keep you going. Come on, go! Go, hurry up! Never get away with this. Shit. Get in! Yeah, I'm still working on it. Hang tight. What about you? You're clear. Go. I can swing by go. and... No, just go. We went to all this trouble to grab her. Beth, I'm counting on you to keep her alive. I'll make my own way out. My plan was simple. There's a bridge to the mainland. I'd fight my way through anything Monarch would throw at me and then steal a car, drive it back to the swimming pool. Just remember, we need your ass alive for the next part. We'll see how it shakes out. All right.
You're clear. Go. I can swing by go. and. No. Just go. We went to all this trouble to grab her. Beth, I'm counting on you to keep her alive. I'll make my own way out. My plan was simple. There's a bridge to the mainland. I'll fight my way through anything Mara to throw at me and I'll steal a car. I'll drive it back to the swimming pool. See how it shakes out. Beth and Dr. Am are all clear, it's time for me to get gone. For that, I need wheels. Valet parking. <laughs> 